All right, hello, it's me, Gold. I'm going to be showing you, in my opinion, the top 10 skins, or the top best skins. Whether that is to get cash or to just be the best. Like, so at number 10, I would say we probably have St. Patrick. It, it's not the worst of shotguns, but it's not that bad. I mean, I mean, it gives you double the cash on a kit, on a kill at a set chance. And disclaimer, there's going to be no paid shotguns, such as the money shotguns, so that would definitely be a top 10, though, no doubt. You kill him, and then this little thing goes up 20% every time you get a kill. Not too bad. And at number 9, we have the bunny skin. The bunny skin is, um, what's a, it's, an, it's only you can double jump with it. Which is pretty good, which means, you know, you just get to higher places, such as the bathroom. You know, if your opponent's chasing you down, all you gotta do is just hit him with one of these, and boom, you're out. You notice there's a random chance to spawn, um, little eggs that'll roll around the map above your head, and they, when you pick them up, they give you 100 cash. This is pretty good, and now we're moving away from the limited time skins onto anchor skin. Which is a very underrated skin, in my opinion. It's also pretty buggy when you do tournaments with it. <laughs> or at least, I'm pretty sure it still is. I don't know, maybe they changed it. Anchor, though, it's pretty underrated. I mean, if I get shot off, or I'll say if I get shot and I'm right here, I'm not, I'm not falling off the map. I'm still, I'm still staying on the map. And there's also this really weird bug that is just very not fun. Never do it. Okay, you just don't. Just it just doesn't make the fun for others. And at number seven we have medic. Medic, as you know my last video, you kill someone, you also you get HP. You use the ability, you get HP. As he if we can kill if we kill this guy. I get HP, there's also a little um kill effect now, which there wasn't before in the past. At number six, we have laser. Okay, I'm gonna be honest. I think I should have placed this the one a bit higher, but it is pretty good. I mean, it's definitely number six. It's definitely in the top ten. I mean, it pretty good ability. I mean, I'm pretty sure you can also have multiple people with it. So I mean, you also shoot it through a wall. So I mean, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. At number five, we have infinity. If you don't know what Infinity does, just go watch one of my other videos. I'll show you what it does. So I'm not going to show you all the abilities. It's just like three different ones. I would have placed this one higher on the tier list, but it is um, has a very high cooldown time, which is not very good. I mean, it's going to be like every minute and five seconds I can use an ability that only lasts for like five seconds. So, at number four, we have Ghost. Now, if you think I should have put this one higher, just comment down below. I think, I think this one's, I think I found a good spot. I know a lot of people say otherwise, folks. I mean, this one's, it is pretty good, actually. I have to admit. I bought it, like, just yesterday. I, I knew what it did, just never tried it. Number three, okay, this may be a very bad opinion, but we have 666. I mean, it's pretty good, right? I mean, let's just say... Get this. Get over here, get over here. Let's say your opponent is like near the edge. Get him with one of these. And then look at dragged in towards it. Okay. They also take damage. And then let's say if it's over the void, then they would have fell down and died. And that's quite a bit of damage, it's just like half HP. So it's pretty good. Also, it's a pretty cool kill effect and pretty annoying. I mean, like, I rage every time I die to it. Number two, this may be number one, honestly, in other people's opinions, but it's air. Air is a really good skin. It's sort of, I mean, it's really good. They also nerfed the cooldown to literally, like, 12 seconds on it, so it's busted. Because it used to be, like, 40 seconds on the cooldown. As you see, if you kill someone, then you get to kill another player. And when you kill another player, you can also kill their kill streak. Now, only after you shoot, if you, like if you shot and missed, then you wouldn't get the kill. 
or if you shot and missed, then if you shot again, you wouldn't get the kills. It also has this change bullet size, which is pretty good. I mean, as you can see, you, I mean, you know how big the bullets are regularly, but now it's this big. And on ability, it also is a bit more damage than some shock. Just a little bit more knockback. Also, it's a not too bad kill effect. And at number one, taking the spot, as in my opinion, the best. UFO. You may say UFO, not that good. Well, explain. Let's say I'm using the dual shotgun, a shotgun that can give you a bunch more cash, but kind of doesn't really do any knockback. But there's a bug with it that solves this issue. But I'm not gonna be going over that today. If I shoot someone with these shotguns. If you can hit it, it actually should be bad. But I mean, look at that. I mean, I'm basically guaranteed a kill with a gun that literally sucks. I mean, okay, this gun doesn't suck. It just doesn't do a lot of knockback, which isn't very good. But yeah, if you disagree or agree with any of this, just write down in the comments and I'll, and I'll see if I like that opinion. And yeah, like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.